Good afternoon. Uh, we have not done any videoing today so far uh, because Janelle is not feeling well. She got a uh, migraine uh, from our trip yesterday from the ride home and she is uh, nursing the effects of that today. So I went to work, even though it's Saturday, usually I don't work at the shop on Saturdays, I usually work at home. But since Janelle is sick, I took all the kids to the shop with me today. It's the last day of September today, and we are not doing any shopping in October. So we need no. to get all our shopping done no. today. There are a handful of things no, we need. No. So I am going to the grocery store with Charity and then three of the girl, the little girls. Because Janelle can't really handle the little girls right now being sick. So here we go. So we're headed off to Hannaford, and we have a $5 off 30 coupon, so we're going to use that. And there's the list Janelle made up for me. Yeah, Carrots, celery, Cheerios. Hey, three things start with C. Uh, tortillas, seltzer, well, I misspelled, but that's okay. Powdered milk. Mary's going to hold it for us. So Janelle likes the seltzer water when she's not feeling well. We got our stuff, except we didn't get a few things. The celery was way too expensive. The, uh, Powdered milk was really expensive. The tortillas were fairly expensive, so we didn't get those. But we got a lot of other stuff. And to get up to our $30, we're just gonna get some hot dogs. Now we're headed over to Price Chopper to get a couple things that were a little too expensive over at Hannaford. We originally weren't going to go to Price Chopper, but uh, well, I have a very hard time paying a lot of money for stuff, and Janelle is a lot better shopper than I am. She can really uh, get the deals at the grocery stores. I have a hard time doing that, so, well, anyway, it really pays to have Janelle around. Charity is pretty good at getting deals, too. She has learned well from her mom. Charity's checking the meat markdowns, and Charity's checking the other markdowns. Anything good? <laughs> you want to buy everything? So we got our celery, which is far cheaper here. We're back from our shopping, and at Hannaford, they gave the kiddos some balloons. I'm not going to lose mine. I'm going to hold on tight on them. That's a good idea. This is not going to. Oh, she'll I'm probably hold tight, too. You're going to hold on tight, right? Yeah. Or else it goes up in the sky. We got our celery and powdered milk at Price Chopper, and the powdered milk is very expensive. It's a little less than $5 a gallon if you were to turn it into milk. Uh, the reason we got it is because you can make more kinds of bread with it, and we'll probably be doing a lot of bread making this month. And we decided not to get the tortillas because they're so expensive, and we'll probably just make them. And Charity said she didn't want to make tortillas, and I said, well, you know what, maybe I'll learn to make tortillas or bread or something. I know what you're saying, Art making tortillas, Art make, doesn't make any food. Yeah, well, one of the reasons for our challenge is, is to get out of our comfort zone. So maybe I will learn, well, I know, kind of know how to make bread, I've done it before, but maybe I'll learn a little bit better how to make bread this time. Janelle's checking out our buys that we got, and... Why so many hot dogs? So we could get up to the 30 Yeah, we had to get up to $30 to get our $5 off. So, and Janelle isn't looking too good right now, as you can tell. Oh, wow. did you tell them why? Yes, I did tell them why. Uh, <laughs> and Mary's having fun with her balloon. All this was $47, and yes, I know it's a little more than I usually spend. And that's why Mommy usually does shopping. So, what do you think? I mean... You had to do what you had to do. This was probably a pretty good Oh, yeah, that was like $10. Yeah, yeah. 12, yeah. What is it? The salary was $1.79 per okay. stock, so that was a pretty good price. Do you think this will help get us to last through a month? Of no shopping? Yeah, this was the, the main thing I wanted was Cheerios for Lillian. Um, just, that's busy food right now, and it's, she's not going to eat a whole ton of them. But compared to the 90 we've had today, it's freezing, and that just screams soup weather. And that I go through a ton of celery, a ton of carrots for soup season. So that's why it was good that you went out and got that. And the girlies are so excited about their balloons. Uh oh, he lost one. And you thoroughly dashed over that I'm not pregnant, and um, this is reason. 
This is residual migraine, right? Right. So I did no tell them that. Has any questions or anything like that? Good night. I hope you enjoyed the video and the shopping trip that we did today. That was our last one in a month. I was really hoping to be able to put together a meal plan and finish cleaning it, cleaning out that lower pantry so I know what's in there and what I need to use so I can put that plan together. But that just didn't happen today with me not feeling all that well. So hopefully Monday, that will be one of my top priorities. Monday is still my baking day. So put my menu together as best as I can, do our baking, and we'll see how the first week goes. What do you think? I'm always one who thinks that we don't need to go shopping and that we can get by with what we have. And then Janelle's the one who thinks, oh, we should probably go and get some stuff that we need. So uh, I'm generally one who thinks that we'll do just fine. The two of us balance each other out. And it'll, I think the first week or two will be easy. And then after that, it'll be harder. No, but I'm not, putting, I'm not putting a lot of stress over this if something does come up. And if it's... Um, in poor taste for our family to mm -hmm. not go shopping, we will be going shopping. So it's not like this. Yeah, um, it's not ironclad. No. I mean, no one's going to die if we go shopping. <laughs> we are just trying not to. It's We're just goal. trying to keep it, other than for the milk and things like that, we're going to keep it pretty low-key. And I know a lot of you guys have been asking me on Facebook about the challenge, and you guys want to enter in. Great. I can't wait to work alongside you and hear what you're cleaning out and what you're cooking. Make sure you put all those, um, the pictures of your food that you're cooking and trying to clean out. You can put them on my Facebook page, or you can tag me on Instagram. I'd love to see what you're doing with your challenge. And I know some of you guys said, well, we can't do a full pantry. We can't do a full pantry clean out. And that's okay. You know, do what works for you and what's best for you. And we'll follow along. Because this is, um, we really want our channel to be encouraging and helping each other and their families and blessing each other. So whatever works for you, if we can inspire you to enter along and do this, Let's have some fun. This, you know, and well, at the end of the month, we'll say, yay. We, we did it. We did it. We accomplished our goal. And, you know, the pantry will be better. I, hey, maybe I'll even get around to tackling the freezer. Uh, maybe. That'd be a good thing. All right. We're going to call it a night. Thanks so much for watching. Hopefully, uh, we'll have a more energetic vlog on Monday. Good night. Good night.